I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats at Smithy TV in downtown Toronto. I'm here with actress Mary Cronert. How does it feel to be uh, working with director Riel Stone on this film that's an adaptation of a Margaret Atwood poem? It's beautiful. Uh, it's so, it's, I just love seeing Canadian art being transformed into other versions of Canadian art. It helps bring it to a wider audience, a different audience. And it really is a beautiful piece, so I'm thrilled. And Roped is the na name of the film. Uh, tell me a little bit about Roped and how it's connected to Margaret Atwood. Well, as I understand it, Roped is based on a poem by Margaret Atwood that's called Half Hanged Mary. It's such a good poem. Everyone go out there and read it. It's beautiful. So dark. <laughs> it is, but again, with that... Uh, Again, one of the things I love about Margaret Atwood, there's still that sense of strength and passion there. Mm -hmm. um, and a little bit of that, you know, that tough whimsy. Half-hanged Mary, I mean, that title alone is, you know, I don't know, I find it a little funny. Is that, does that yeah. make me weird? No, it's dar it's a dark sense of humor, but it's not weird. <laughs> <laughs> you can say it's weird. It's yeah. all right. It's okay. okay, it's super weird. <laughs> and you play Mary in the film as well. So, you know, when you auditioned, were you like, I, my name is Mary, I can do this. <laughs> Give me the part, it's mine. Um, it was an intense audition process uh, because the, the film itself is very lyrical. A lot of the, the dialogue, it's, it's an internal monologue again for a lot of the piece. So it, what you're seeing on the film is very different from, or, or maybe you're getting another layer through hearing her voice to part of the film, so especially, like, mostly from when they're trying to kill her, when she's hanging from this tree. So you, the audition was really just about going to those places. What is it like to be hanging there, to be left alone, to be devastated? Mm -hmm. um, what kind of conversations do you have with yourself and the universe when you're waiting to die? Absolutely. Hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> and this is sort of uh, surrounding a witch trial type situation. Is that right? It feels like mm. it. Uh, but again, like all, all those stories, uh, she's just a simple woman who uses the land and nature and her knowledge to help people. Um, something that other people couldn't understand and that's why you know they feel they have to kill her. They, they can't have that, I suppose. Absolutely. Um, and switching gears a little bit, mm -hmm. Tell me a little bit about the work that you do at the Art Center. <laughs> Thank you for asking, Katie. Uh, yeah, well, as an actor, I'm, I'm just, I hate not being busy all the time. So for me, again, one of the things I love about art is its transformative nature, how it helps people, how it helps us grow and connect with one another. So uh, when I'm not acting, if I'm not acting, I'm working on a nonprofit community art studio that's based out of Oshawa, Ontario, a place where people can come and create whatever they need or want to create for free, so whether that's poetry, film, music, visual arts, sculpture. And is it geared toward children in particular or all ages? Everyone. We welcome everyone because the arts are something that should be accessible to everyone. No one should have to pay or not be able to pay to get that opportunity to create and connect with other people who feel the same way. And where's the best place for us to find out more information on you and the various things that you're working on online? Well, you can always visit my website, marycroner.com. You can visit the Living Rooms website at livingroomcommunityartstudio.org uh, and all the other usuals, Facebook, Twitter, those kind of things. Okay. Well, thank you so much, and it's lovely to, lovely to see you again. Nice to see you, too. Thank again. you. I'm Katie Allman, reporting for Katie Chat in downtown Toronto. watching the show if you like it please please subscribe also when I'm not interviewing I am an actress and if you would like to check out some of my acting you can click here uh, thanks again guys <laughs>